He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean... He may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. <laughs> He looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Yeah. Tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davey got shot. Mac and John. Both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Hold. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Yeah, a lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about that. 
this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Now, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Almost there, boy. Come on, dude. Hey, look. Over there. You see that? John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. Let's see if he can hear us. Come on! Up there! from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Watch out here. You sure about this? Oh, yeah. It's coming from this way. Okay. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Careful here. Stay low under here. Okay, from here. Watch your stairs. It's real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Get up here. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't 
down just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Distract him while you get to the horse. Go! Draw him off. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Oh. <laughs> we're getting you out of here. Hey, over here! Don't bring them this way. Oh, it's easy. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. Got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. If you and Dutch talk about how we're gonna get out of this, I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East into all that—that civilization. I know. 
The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <sighs>